I think it's an important issue for the thalassemia working group, the light alliance of the Southeast Asian country. I think all of you know about the challenge in the future for thalassemia working, especially for the diagnosis, treatment, and how we can to contribute for the skinning. And this organization can cause the gap of our country, especially for sharing the knowledge with the specialists of the working group in Southeast Asian country. In Thailand, we commitment for the support alliance for close the gap for diagnosis and treatment of the thalassemia in the future. We have the aim and the goal for eliminate thalassemia in the future, especially early diagnosis before pregnancy. I think Thailand can collaborate with another country, especially for all ASEAN countries. We have the common goal to eliminate all the thalassemia in the future. Alliance is a very important team up for the Southeast Asia countries. Work together to reduce this kind of disease from the human history. I think we should speed up, erase this disease. People realize how much cost for this kind of disease, the family issues, social issues. Now we have this technology can really reduce this kind of cost. The time is coming, so we just quickly put in the actions. If we team up, take the leading role, I think all the South countries will join us. We are really leading the way to make a history. BGI should support people doing some good things to give the technology support, raising the super quality, lower the cost, save the life. Telestry is a big problem. If we have this alliance, we can cooperate together so that we can create innovation on diagnosis and also the way for cooperate all the, all the treatment together from every country in this area. So we can cross to a good function of treatment of diagnosis and innovation in all together. In Chiang Mai University, we have the faculty of associated medical so that we can have the research in this area and then contribute to other countries about this knowledge and then we can make another innovation on this kind of subject. It is highly significant, especially if we aim to free Southeast Asia from one of the thalassemia belt in the world, we can develop more harmonized strategies, accelerate the adoption of approaches tailored to each country, and speed up the implementation of the latest diagnostic and treatment advancement. Harapan kita Women and Children Hospital, as the thalassemia research center appointed by the Indonesian Ministry of Health, we are committed to collaborating in research strengthening laboratory capabilities and promoting the use of innovative technologies such as NGS for more accurate and earlier diagnosis. For Vietnam, we are the low middle income countries and we are facing with a lot of issues related to healthcare system. With a regional alliance, we will have a regional action plan and through that we can now have a regional procurement, regional uh, negotiations and reduce the fee for the diagnosis for treatment for prevention. Our organization can contribute the experience to build the patient registry. We can support them, that is, help the patients, help the society, help the policy maker to have enough awareness about thalassemia when joining with this alliance can support for the patients in Vietnam and also other countries. The alliance will help us in the thalassemia, in the early diagnosis, prevention, and the treatment. As we know that thalassemia is a regional problem, no single country is not fighting alone. We can have the trans bodily collaborate together. I think this alliance is not the only scientific and medical partnership. I think it will have the innovation, prevention, sustainability to fight thalassemia together in Southeast Asia. We can be the regional hub for training and everything. We can be the ecosystem for thalassemia prevention, diagnosis, and treatment. We can be the bridge to bridge everyone in Southeast Asia to China technology in terms of thalassemia.